G'day folks, Ben from Snowy's here today, down at the four-wheel drive show on Darchi stand where we're talking about their products. With me here I've got a unique product, this is the Darchi Extender 2 tent. It's an awning tent, it attaches to an awning but it's also freestanding so you can attach this to your awning. I know when you're out during the day, leave it standing, unzip it, drive off, come back at night and attach it again. Now these pack up small, but they've still got space inside. Inside we've got 2.6 metres of length, the 2 metres wide and a 1.8 metres high at the front here. Now one of the key features of these is the pack size of the tent. It's 16.3 kilos, 0.8 metres long, about 28 centimetres high, 28 centimetres deep. Much smaller, great for people with small cars. Talking about the features of the tent, it's a 210 denier polyester ripstop material. The floor is a 370 GSM PVC bucket floor, so plenty of durability or saving on weight. At the front of the tent here, we've got a double door. There's an insect proof mesh panel here and a solid panel that will completely enclose this, this uh, opening here. As we come around the side, we can see we've got guy ropes in place. There is a closable mesh vent here. It's just a little Velcro kickstand there that we can close that up if we like. We'll leave it open for ventilation. Coming further down the back of the tent, got another mesh window here with a panel that zips closed to keep the weather out. Another mesh panel at the back here, but once again, this is rolled up at the moment, that'll zip close to keep the weather out. And at the very rear, we've got a gusseted window, so you can peg it slightly open, you can completely roll it open if you like, or you can zip it completely closed if the weather's really bad. Lots of options there. Now one of the unique things about this tent is this here. This is both the fly and the awning that goes out in front of the tent. At the moment, there are these attachment points and some Velcro up here to keep this in place. We can peg this out the back here. It creates a fly sheet that goes over the top. Alternatively, if I was to undo all of these and extend this back out the other way to the front of the tent here, this suddenly becomes an awning shelter out the front of the tent, should I not have an awning that I'm using on my vehicle. So it's quite unique, quite versatile. If we step inside the tent, I'll show you the features in there. So looking inside here, Dutch, you've kept things pretty simple for the extender tent, I guess to keep weight down. So there are some, uh, some Velcro tabs here to attach the cord to as it comes in through this electrical access point here. Here's a small hook at the top here for a lantern. Apart from that, inside, it's pretty straightforward. So one of the key features I want to show you with the extender tent is how it attaches to an awning. This one's freestanding at the moment. This one here is actually attached to an awning. Now with your extender tent, you'll get this panel here. It attaches via a sail truck on one side and a zipper on the other. If we undo this zip, we can detach the tent from our vehicle awning and drive away with our vehicle, pack our awning up. We can take this panel out if we like. It just sits, it sits a standard six wheel sail truck there. So this tent is now freestanding. We come back to our camp at the end of the night. We pull the vehicle up and we can zip this closed again and it becomes a waterproof attachment between our sleeping quarters and our awning. Rain catches in here. So that's the Darchi Extender 2 Touring Tent, a great lightweight option for those who don't have the room for some of the larger bulky canvas tents. You can grab these at snowies.com.au, lowest prices every day with free delivery to just about anywhere in Australia. Thanks again for watching, we'll see you next time.